hey beautiful libras welcome back to the channel guys thank you so much for joining me here thank you for all your generosity to me and toward this channel i do appreciate it welcome you new subscribers and welcome back everyone who has been helping this channel to grow the way that it has you guys are very generous and i thank you deeply Let's go Libra. Empowerment. The spirit of empowerment. Honor. Purification. Love. The spirit of love. The spirit of destruction. <laughs> the truth. What is ever pure, and you always got some damn enemy trying to destroy it. That's what this read is saying. Creativity, solidness, the magician, seeding. Hmm. Caregiver, support, and the rhythm maker. You sow good seeds. Offering support here. A grandfather. The presence of a grandfather is here. Offering you support. Hmm. A grandfather may... You could be a grandfather, but there is the presence of a grandfather here. May have worked with the ground or was a planter, a harvester, planting someone to do with gardening or harvesting here what's going on forgiveness is here for leaving or traveling atlantis is here knighthood is here Lessons and blessings. Spouse is here. Someone wants forgiveness for leaving or traveling. What's going on? Capricorn energy. What you desire will require hard work and sustained effort. It'll not be an easy path, but you will gain wisdom. The heart, the energy of love surrounds you. Open your heart and you will attract what your heart desires. Something is brewing. Something special is brewing. It will flow naturally and beautifully. This transition will be smooth and painless. Divine power. 
believe in the divine power within you because once it's awakened, a whole new life will take shape for you. It's entirely up to you if you want to continue on the same path or take a risk and start something new. Something has been kept all bottled up. What have you been ignoring, denying, or avoiding? Whatever you're protecting, release it and free yourself. Wait for the conditions to be right. What is it that you're wanting and needing in your life will soon manifest. You've got the support of a grandfather here. Or you are offering, you are a caregiver for your grandfather or a grandfather is coming through. This is home. This is stability. It's entirely up to you to continue on the same path or take a risk and start something new. child or grandchild or growth, happiness. What is it that you're not seeing? What is it that you're not aware of? What are you not seeing? What do you need to release? What are you keeping bottled up and set it free? Is this a marriage or is this lessons and blessings? Divine wisdom, depression, this is the spirit of truth. Is it a to do with? you sow good seeds this is like um, a craftsman this is somebody who works hard dedicated trusting your intuition this is a father or a grandfather working is some kind of argument or some kind of fight. Judgment. Make a decision. What is it that someone is keeping bottled up that they need to release? Is this a decision? Is this an argument? Is this a anger, resentment over a third party? I mean the king and queen of cups is here. Somebody got to release some kind of third party is that what they need to release or is it that they need to release anger 
somebody's keeping something all bottled up. Is this caregiving? Is this sickness? Okay. You may be in a supportive role or offering support or there is support. This is offering support here. Supporting someone through some kind of sickness or illness? Or is that Somebody is keeping something all bottled up within. There's healing here. Or someone is wishing this is healing. Healing from... Uh, this is strength, empowerment. This is... Making a decision... Something has been overwhelming. There's a masculine energy here. Oh. Who is holding on to some heavy burden. Or do they feel like they are a burden? Aww. What's this? Oh, shit. There's a tower here, and someone. Oh, this will be hard work. This will be Capricorn energy. This will be hard work. Hard work. Came out with this Capricorn meaning. This is about discipline, seriousness, and hard work. What you're desiring is going to require hard work and sustained effort. It will not be an easy path, but you will gain wisdom. And that's what this Capricorn energy means means that this is not going to be an easy path. It will require a lot of hard work. And it's saying you can, this is a masculine energy. So it's saying that it's going to require a lot of hard work. This is not going to be an easy path. But you can stay on the same path that you're on. Or you can take a risk and change it and go on a different path. So somebody is very stressed out. This is a grandfather and a father. Jeez. So what's this about? Is there a grandfather here who is giving you support? Is Are they a grandfather? It's not going to be an easy path. It's going to require a lot of hard work. But you will gain a lot of lessons from something. Hang on, Libra. Okay, welcome back. Sorry about that, Libra. I had to take that call. So there is a definitely a grandfather here. Now, I don't know if you are the care provider for this grandfather, or that is what this grandfather is worrying about. Maybe they're worrying about you know, the path that they're choosing or, or is going to require a lot of work. And it's looked like somebody is trying to make a decision 
about what path they want to choose. Let's see. Oh, geez. What's going on here? Um, trying to make a some kind of an, a, an arrangement or something like here. Or trying to make a, a decision about a path. It, it's almost as if this person... wants to like what's going on here somebody would have to reject somebody what in the hell is this and why are there so many people here Oh God, so this person is trying to make a decision here whether they should stay on the same path that they were on or choose a new direction, a new path. This is not going to be easy. This is going to be a lot of hard work is going to be involved here. So what's going on? Something to do with family, uh, travel and family or having to give give care it's it's about care pro providing uh, care here so someone is feeling trapped or worried or is regretting something here Who are they going to hurt? Oh, fuck. Give me a break. So that's what this is coming down to. Could have taken this path here with the empress they could have the i mean these are gifts these are gifts these are the gifts of god god will provide god will provide here god will give care here this is caregiving this is giving care um why is this person struggling so hard here take a leap of faith I can stay on the path that I'm on or I can go to another path but the path that I might be going to is going to be extremely extremely hard here what the hell so somebody is like ah, Jesus Christ What are you doing? I don't get this person. Like, I don't get it. It's like... Who the hell is this person talking to? I mean, they don't know that if they had chosen this path with the Empress... They would have got all the blessings of the universe here. Like, for real. All the aces are here. 
But maybe when this person was making their decision, I mean, this is high honor. This is integrity. Somebody is like wanting to, holy God. I don't understand what the hell is going on here. So this person, ends a relationship. It's about a relationship choice. What the hell's going on? Divine timing. Wait for conditions to be right. What you're wanting and needing in your life will soon manifest. But Oh my God. So, <clears throat> this person was so fucking confused of what they should do because it would seem as if know if somebody talked this person out of being with their true love like why did this person choose such a hard path you know, one was obviously a blessing and one was obviously a lesson. They chose a lesson over a blessing. Look at it. It's going to require such hard work. We could be talking about like a masculine energy who may have been at a crossroads. Well, I can stay on the same path I'm on and I will receive all these blessings or I can choose a lesson. They chose a fucking lesson. A very painful fucking lesson. And now it's looking like they're waiting for the conditions to be right so that they can come back to their true love. This is weird energy. So this person was giving to two and they had to choose one path or another path and I think this person made their choice or their decision based upon what their buddies told them to do or 
Maybe they're talking to their buddies or something here. I don't know. Like, okay, what I'm getting is that for some of you, I'm going to say it straight up. For some of you, this is an older emperor, okay, who actually could be a grandfather, okay? And Holy fuck. Why did they choose such a hard path? Somebody is like, this other lover This is family shame and embarrassment. They would have had to hurt this other lover. But what they don't realize is that this other lover is a karmic lesson. This person is manipulating them. They could have married this other lover or committed to this other lover, but what they don't see is that this person this other lover is trapping them. <sighs> Fuck sakes. They were greedy, no doubt. They were giving to two. Now, look. Oh my God. I don't know if, okay, I'm going to say it straight up here. This masculine energy got manipulated by another lover. This <clears throat> Jesus. They cheated, okay? But this isn't like an older masculine who may be a grandfather. And they go out they may have gotten someone young pregnant. And they got it in their head. Now it's like, holy fuck, this person really messed up here. So they start talking to another lover, like they start talking to somebody else. They seduce this person into having sex. This person gets pregnant. 
The dilemma seems to be here, for some, not all. This is a grandfather who's having kids. They've already raised a family. They've already had their children. And their children are had children. This is a grandfather who is getting someone, another lover, pregnant. And, like... So this person has responsibilities and duties to their existing children. They have responsibilities and duties to their grandchildren. And now it's like they're starting a family all over again. This person going to be working to the day they die. I swear to God. Holy fuck. And had they kept their promises, kept their word to this empress, think what they would have had. All the blessings. Jesus. I don't know what this is all about. That's for some of you. This is an older masculine who is getting tricked by this other lover. It's like, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, you know, seduce them, lured them. And it's looking like the people around them have been telling them, man, you're going to have a hard path. You're going to have a hard path. Like, this is going, how are you going to, like, provide for your own children, your own family, and now restarting another family? And they're worried about... family embarrassment like they regret this starting this other family holy god I mean the blessings is there could be a child out of this it's a karmic child mind you this is going to be a hard 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 path but this person gonna learn a lot they're going broke they feel defeated they feel stuck they feel hurt they feel embarrassed. They feel remorseful. This person now got to explain to all their other family members what they have done. Imagine. So you could have, oh yeah, they got a family. Like a grown family. These are adults, like their kids might be 30 or 40 years old or more. And they're starting, and now they got a baby. So they have grandchildren, they're a grandfather having a baby, a new baby. They're already a grandfather. And they're starting out a new family with a baby? <sighs> oh. They chose a lesson, and a very hard one. And I'm not saying, I'm not being like, oh, it's, they chose this path. So, like, what's not fair here is, like, this new baby, it, they're going to be dead 
by the time this child's a teenager. And this child is, is going to grow up not knowing who their father is. Or their existing family It's like telling them, why are you choosing such a hard path? Like, this is going to be incredibly hard. This person was planning, it's looking like, on retiring. They cannot retire. They've got to provide. They're a provider. They can't retire. They cannot... For others of you, that is not the story. For others of you, you could be the care provider. Oh my good God. This is an older masculine I'm picking up on who, had, <coughs> who is a grandfather. And this grandfather is starting a new family with probably someone well obviously they're young enough to uh, produce a child like child rearing years this person <sighs> what's the truth here spirit Had they chosen the Empress, okay, they would have had, you know, you would have sat there and, and grow old together, have all the money in the bank, ha had been able to enjoy your families and your grandchildren together and raise them together and all this stuff. But they chose a path of like, starting a new family all over again. When they were planning on retiring. Okay. Other Libras. Other Libras. Okay, well, this person is defeated. They are regretful. They are remorseful. They are humiliated or embarrassed. They cheated and they regret it. They chose a heavy path, boy. That's the path they chose. Screwing around. Producing a child. Reaping what they've sown. Now they see they're not, they were not looking forward to this. This is something they were not looking forward to. This is something this person stressed the hell over about. Now they got to tell their grandchildren, How? what does that make them? Now they got to tell their grandchildren that they're having a baby. They got to tell their grandchildren that they're, at, what does that make that then? I'm confused. If you have grandchildren and you go out and you have a baby a son or a daughter, what does that make the grandchildren to that new baby? I'm confused. I don't even know what that would be. Please put it in the comments if you know. If you have grandchildren 
and then you go out and have another child. What do the grandchildren call that child? Like, cousin? I don't know what what that would be. I'm sure I don't. Yeah, now they got to tell their grandchildren that they're having a baby. Because of their selfishness? Yeah. Now this is hurting the family, see? Their family is very in despair about what this person did. They are in despair about what this person did because now this person is worried that they have hurt their family. Well, they have. Because, okay, I'm going to be realistic. Okay, if my dad, say for example, something happened to my mom or whatever. My dad went out and started a second family when he's like old. And then I, I've got grandchildren or he has grandchildren, like I have kids. What do my kids call their grandfather's new baby? I really honestly don't know the answer to that. I'm sorry. You gotta help me out here. But that's what's going on. Now they gotta go back to their family and tell them what they did. Now, if my dad did that and I was their daughter and I have kids, grow, you know, my kids are growing up or whatever, I got to tell my kids that grandpa's having a baby. <laughs> Whoa. For a one night stand or a flight? Oh, my Lord, have mercy on me. Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. What the hell? Lesson. <sighs> A secret. Are you kidding me? How are you going to keep this a secret? That's what their family is saying. Like, how can you keep this a secret? Damn. They are pushing. Look. This emperor that I'm picking up on. Who is looking not so divine here, okay? People and their family are trying to push them away, resist them. Their own grandchildren are pushing this grandfather away. Their grandfather away. Because it's confusing. Yep. Yep. Trap them. And their family knows it. So they marry him? Their other family feels betrayed.
You got a grandson or a grandchildren that might have a couple of grandkids? It's a karmic child. Who planned this? So to be real, is this DNA? Okay, what's going on? They were playing around. They took a leap of faith. They were giving to two. Jesus. Guess what? This person tried to pay to get an abortion or looking into adoption or something like this. Miscarriage. My eyes twitching now. I'm already stressed out so I know this person was they could have oh Jesus this person was stressed out they did not want this to happen they could have They were abandoning you. They could have left you out in the cold. Okay? Thinking that they could cover all this up if they had, if this other lover had gotten an abortion or miscarried or something like that. This. They could have paid to have this done, but there's something funky going on. They changed their mind, or they said, no, I don't believe in that. They talked about adoption. They talked about... I'm keeping my baby... third party <coughs> yeah they're pissed off see either this karmic said that they couldn't get pregnant that they had some kind of illness or that they, they, they had some kind of surgery so they couldn't get pregnant or something like that with a surgeon Anyways, they got pregnant.
Yep. Their family, the people around this masculine, knows that this other lover got pregnant on purpose to because this person had money. It's entrapment. It is. They was lying about that they couldn't get pregnant, that they couldn't have kids or whatever. They told them. They got them pregnant. They broke your heart. So even if this person, okay, that's one story, someone old like this. For others of you, it's just because this person could have got someone pregnant. Their family ain't happy about it at all. They hurt you that they allege to love you, but that's the choice they had to make. Well, it is kind of justice. Spirit is saying it's justice because they put you in a competition. They, they're the ones that stepped out and that is what they got to live with. There are lessons in this life and there are blessings in this life. And this person did not see and recognize that they had a blessing. And so they've chosen a very hard, hard path. Their family is not happy with this. They're not, they are not, they are not. Some of their families have turned their backs on this person. Like it's embarrassing. They're embarrassed. They want your forgiveness. They're waiting for divine timing, for the conditions to be right. To come toward you, to, to ask your forgiveness. But you might want to know that whilst this person is gone they may have married someone else they may have had children with someone else This is a destructive force. This is a karmic child. All children are blessings, but not when you're this old. <laughs> Imagine how, how, how do you start all over again? why they can't face you they can't face you they're embarrassed to say what they have done kids I don't know I'm confused I don't know how that stuff works 
I'm going to have to Google it to figure it out. <laughs> I honestly don't know. What do they call them? Cousins? Uncles? Aunties? I don't know. It's going to be very hard. Very hard. First of all, their family does not like this gold digger. Second of all, it's like a total, totally hard pill to swallow for their family. Totally hard. I'm not here to judge. I'm just reading the cards and that's what it's saying. So, how are they? They can't face you. They can't tell you the truth. They can barely tell their own family the truth. This is a powerful destructive force. And now it's looking like <sighs> this is old people's hands. That this person is always going to love you. <laughs> this is growing old together. It's going to take a whole lot of forgiveness. If you decide to take this person back. Because there's a lot that goes with it. For others of you. No, spirits like that is this read. Okay, for others of you that aren't involved in a situation like that, it's still a karmic energy who is very destructive. And like I said originally, you know, whenever you've got a true love situation, you always got this destructive force that tries to come in your relationships. And it's like you have got to be very, very strong. In true love relationships, you cannot listen to your friends. You cannot listen to other people. You cannot be lured and enticed by the enemy because anything that is of God ensures how this destruction follows. This person got seduced.
they charmed him. And they deceived you. They did. It's going to take a whole lot of forgiveness to forgive this. want to keep a love you've got to fight for it and you can allow the enemy to come in your relationships this person allowed the enemy and they opened the door for the enemy by doing this and they've got a hard hard road exhaustion exhaustion heavy burdens, loss of money, responsibilities. This could collapse this person's whole family dynamicism that they have with their family, their kids, their grandkids. It's just like, oh my God, the amount of pressure that is on this person's life, I could not express strong enough. Take care.